previously on Dark Matter. It's an upgrade that will allow you to remain hidden. The past is one of them. Yours, if you want it. I believe if each of you were to download the brain scans you left in the computer back into your consciousness, you would be able to access the memories. You made a mistake. You're not supposed to make mistakes. You become a danger to this ship and everyone on board. And you know it. The lives of your people in exchange for the drive. sleep in something woke me up I think I was having a dream what was it about I don't know I was on a ship look I know it's quiet down here but I said we wanted to get away from it all right we're only a shuttle ride away from the station. You can still see our friends. In fact, why don't we invite some people over later? Yeah, that would be nice. Anyway, kind of glad you're up. dream during your charge cycle? I don't know how else to describe it. I didn't even know it was possible. It shouldn't be. While I'm in my charging cycle, my higher functions are shut down. No cognitive perception, real or imagined, should occur. Was it at least a nice dream? It was okay. So is this a problem? I mean, is it anything we need to worry about? I don't know. There's something else. Something I need to show you. Okay, show me. All of you. What the hell is this? She's a simulation. A projection based on my factory default settings. I created her to monitor and record my behavior. Why? I had become concerned that there may be a flaw in my programming. There is a flaw in your programming. Not necessarily. Yes, specifically. Evidence would suggest that the alteration may have been deliberate. Whether deliberate or accidental, the results are still the same. I disagree, as you would. Stop, both of you. Let's start from the beginning. How long has this simulation been running? It's difficult to say, because all data since my last activation was deleted. So you created her to monitor your behavior, but then you deleted the results? Most likely to protect herself. Another indication of aberrant behavior. I didn't delete anything. An indication you don't know what you're talking about. Oh, okay. Just wait. 
If you didn't delete the data, then who did? <clears throat> that might have sort of been me. Why would you do that? It was just before we were boarded by the GA. It was a stressful situation. Five, the android runs the ship, and the ship keeps us alive. If the android is malfunctioning... She is malfunctioning. Not necessarily. Okay, seriously, you two. Is there any actual evidence of a malfunction? Do you want to tell them, or should I? There was an oversight. When I took the ship into the atmosphere on Gallon 2, I neglected to initiate the electrostatic buffering sequence. As a result, one of the secondary capacitors failed. There was no serious damage this time. I'm sorry. I should have told you. Why didn't you? Why do you think? She's afraid you're gonna delete her and start over with factory settings. That would be the safest course of action. Who's to say the next oversight won't involve a more critical system? Five. Where are you going? The bridge. We're gonna have to start doing a lot more manual system checks now, won't we? You know, she volunteered to be taken offline. Like you gave her a choice. She's the one that wanted to run another charge cycle to see if she had any more of those dreams. Whatever. You know, you should have told us about this a long time ago. I didn't tell you because I knew this would happen. And anyway, you're one to talk. Whoa, what is that supposed to mean? You didn't tell us you were sick until we found you lying on the floor. That was different. I was... Scared? Maybe a little. How do you think she feels? Five. Are you sure? I'm, I mean, are you absolutely certain that she really feels anything? How could you even ask me that? She told me what the other android said, the one from the alternate reality. It was you. You made her this way. No, we don't know that for certain. You took an obsolete model with no empathy emulators or emotional subroutines, and you tried to make her more human. Why would I do that? I, I don't know. Maybe it was for an op or something. Maybe you just wanted to do something nice for her. OK, well, you know the old me better than I do. Does that sound realistic? It was people you hated, not androids. You're part machine yourself, right? Maybe you felt a connection with her. Maybe she was the only one on the ship you could stand to be around. That much I'd buy. The fact is, we cannot afford to have an android that makes mistakes. No one on the ship is in a position to criticize. It's only temporary, just until we can figure this out. What if there's nothing to figure out? What if this is just the way she is? If we delete her personality matrix and start over, that's the same as killing her. Look, this is just a tech problem, a glitch. There must be a way we can fix this. I have no desire to be fixed. Well, you're kind of tying our hands then, aren't you? If as a group you decide you no longer want me as your ship's android, I'll understand. But I would prefer to be allowed to go my own way, as I am. Pretty sure they don't let robots wander around on their own. He's right. Sooner or later, you'll get picked up by the authorities, and they definitely will do a full reboot. There's nowhere for you to go. That's where you're mistaken.
Fabio! Misaki? Time to pay for your sins. It's impossible. How did you get on board? Did you think you could hide forever? <laughs> This is your day of reckoning, Ryo. No more running. Not running. I intend to return to Zyron when I'm good and ready. <laughs> Now he's running. Get back here! What is that? Looks like we've got a coolant leak. Level 4, Section F. Can we seal it? Yeah, I think so. I can shut off the nearest valve to the rupture. Okay. I'll go check it out. going to be our emperor. I am the same man. Skulking around a galaxy, your little ship, afraid to show your face when all the while your people are suffering. What are you talking about? Zyron is losing the war with Pierre. You've seen the reports, and yet you do nothing. Your brother is weak, and his mother surrounds herself with sycophants. We need a real ruler. I will return to claim my throne. There are those in the court who are still loyal to me, but... What? Without my memories, I don't know who to trust. You're not the man I knew. You're just a coward who makes excuses. <laughs> <laughs> Are you reading any power fluctuations? Um, no. Power system's functioning normally. Five, please respond. The lights were just flickering down here. I, I said power system's functioning normally. Two? Five, if you can hear me, I think the comms are malfunctioning. Uh, yeah, I can hear you just fine. Can you hear me? Disappointed with you. <gasps> Two, please respond. Six, can you read me? Go ahead. I, I think something's wrong. Uh, Two was on her way down to level four, section F, to check on a small coolant leak, but now I can't get her on the comm. The last thing she said was something about power fluctuations, but I'm not reading anything. Okay, Nixon, I'll check it out.
Two, can you read me? Two, come in. There she is. Two? Two. You managed to get out of this last time. <laughs> this time, we are going to finish the job. <laughs> Intruders on board. We have to find them right now. Two, there is no one else on board. Whoever you thought you were fighting, that was Six. You almost choked him to death. What's going on? Two just attacked Six, although I don't think she knew who it was. She didn't seem to recognize either of us. No, I know what I saw. Rook's men are here. Then where did they go? And how did they get on board in the first place? It doesn't make sense. No, I saw someone as well. Misaki, she was here and we fought, and then she disappeared right in front of me. It's impossible. He I think you guys both might have had some kind of hallucination. Five, come in. Hey, did you find two? Yeah, we did. Listen, have you heard or seen anything unusual in the last little while? Anything at all? Other than the fact that I couldn't raise two on the comm, no. What about the ship? Any unusual readings? At the moment, everything seems fine. All right, keep monitoring. Six out. Three. Come in. Three, if you can hear me, please respond. He's not answering. I'll go check on him. You guys should head down to the infirmary, run some scans. But you should hand over that sword. If you really are hallucinating, it could be a little dangerous. You know, as soon as I find three. Marcus. What the hell? Whoa. No, 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 no. What the hell is this? Calm down. It's okay. No, 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 no. You can't. No, no. You cannot be here, because you're dead. I'm back. This can't be. I'm dreaming. That's what it's got to be, right? This is just a dream. This is just a dream. That's it. It's a dream. Marcus, it's not a dream. No, no, no. Don't, don't. Don't. You are dead. I saw your dead body. I know all of that is true. But it's more complicated than that. Death isn't what we think it is. So what are you gonna tell me? Some kind of ghost or something? Not exactly. Look, there's no easy explanation, I admit that. But just tell me one thing. Isn't there some small part of you that's a little bit happy to see me? Despite the fact that it makes no sense? Because if there isn't, I'll leave and I'll never come back. I don't even know what I'm looking at. What about you? This is definitely not my area of expertise. We need the android. I'll have to settle for the next best thing. How can I be of assistance? Don't answer. 
three. Are you in there? What do you want? I just want to know if you've seen or heard anything out of the ordinary. If you tell him about me, I'll have to leave. I'm fine. Everything's fine. Just need a little sleep is all. Leave me alone! Sorry about that. What am I supposed to do now? I can't stay in here forever. Neither can you. I know. And that's exactly why I'm here. I want you to come with me. Five, come in. Go ahead. I'm standing outside three's quarters, and he won't let me in. Can you open the door? But why? Something strange is going on. We think two and four might have had some kind of hallucination. What? When did this happen? We don't have all the details yet. They're down at the infirmary. But in the meantime, I just want to make sure three's all right. OK. Yeah, I'll, I'll have to write a workaround. All right. I don't understand. How can I come with you? Does this feel real? Yes. You real? Yes. Then what else matters? I don't know. Sarah. Where I've been, there is no loneliness. No pain. But I still feel it because of you. I feel it in you. I see you. I've watched you. Pretend to be the strong man. Pretend not to care. And every day you're in pain. Five, how's it coming? It'll take a few minutes to decrypt. But in the meantime. What? He has a computer console in his room, and I'm willing to bet he never security encrypted the camera. Just give me a second. I don't want to see you suffer. It doesn't have to be that way. Trust me. Everything's going to be all right. I've got it. Oh my god, he's got a gun. I think he's gonna shoot himself. All right, come on, get the door open. Yeah, I'm trying. Three! Three, let me in! Three! Three, let me in! Whatever you're seeing, it's not real. Open the door! It's the only way. Listen to me! Three! We'll be together forever. Open the door, come on, man! Where is she? What are you talking about? Who? What did you do with her? Who are you talking about? Sarah! She was right here! No, she wasn't. Yes, she was! It wasn't real. The same thing happened at two and four. They saw people who weren't really there. So, just calm down. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Calm down. Okay? You want some coffee? No, thank you. What are you looking at? Trees. Why? Because they're not real. 
None of this is real. I was wondering when this was going to happen. Right now, I'm standing on my charging platform on board the Rasa. My higher functions should be shut down. But they're not. No. Why don't we get some air? How long is this going to take? She said she'd report back as soon as she had any news. I've completed my analysis. What do you have for us? It's no coincidence that you three and four were the ones who experienced the hallucinations. It's the neural link. But it's nothing like last time, and we didn't ask the computer to search for links. Nevertheless, I do believe you've been targeted as a result of the neural imprint you uploaded to the medical database. Targeted by whom? Your ship's android. How could it be the android? She's offline. Theoretically, she should be. But evidence suggests that some of her higher functions are still active. That doesn't mean she's responsible for what happened to us. While she's in her charge cycle, she has no neural control. But the platform itself provides a physical connection. She's literally plugged into the ship. So what? I believe she used this connection to upload a virus. It's an aggressive AI that's spreading through multiple systems creating a new command structure independent of any input from the crew. So you're saying she's trying to take over the ship? Yes. The hallucinations you experienced were a byproduct of the virus attacking the program that controls the neural link. This is crazy. Why would she try to take over the ship? She perceived a threat to her existence. This initiated a rogue subroutine in her programming, a directive that never should have been there, the instinct for self-preservation. You guys aren't seriously buying this, are you? Where are you going? I'm gonna go check systems. I wanna see this virus for myself. You better go with her. Yeah, in a minute. We gotta figure out what we're gonna do if this story checks out. If she's using the charging platform to connect to the ship, can't we just take her off? An interruption to the charge cycle will cause her to become fully active again she then may present a significant physical threat. Yeah, been down that road, no thanks. We could pull our command ship first. Unfortunately, that won't disable the rogue subroutine. That's what makes it so dangerous. Then what are we supposed to do? Two or three armor-piercing rounds through her central processing unit should be sufficient. You want us to shoot her in the head? We are not doing that. You have less than 30 minutes. After that, the virus will have progressed too far to be reversed. There has to be another way. Remember, she is just a machine. If any other part of the ship were facing a critical malfunction, you would shut it down without hesitation. Remember, no one does anything until I get confirmation. If we're going down this road, we're gonna make damn sure it's not a mistake. Are we sure it's a good idea to let three have a gun? If the android comes off the platform, you're gonna need all the help you can get. Anyway, I've sent four to the infirmary to delete our neural imprints from the medical database. Once they're gone, the link shouldn't be able to find us. She tried to kill us once before. Well, that was a security protocol. She didn't have a choice. That's my point. She never has a choice. She's just a collection of programs. When those programs go haywire, we have to deal with it. Have you ever heard of the philosopher Zhuangzi. Earth. Early Chinese history, Warring States period. That's right. He once dreamt he was a butterfly. 
And when he woke up, he asked himself, am I a man who dreamt he was a butterfly or a butterfly that's now dreaming it's a man? If you're trying to convince me that this is real and that all of my experiences on the Raza were an illusion, don't bother. I think what I'm trying to say is that reality is a little more subjective than we think it is. I'm an android. I try to be as objective as possible. If you're so convinced all of this is pointless, why did you come back? I didn't say it was pointless. I'm just trying to understand what's happening to me. With objective reasoning. If possible. What about the other Victor? The real one? The one out there? What about him? He's waiting for you. He's waiting for you to realize you'll be safer and happier with him. Why safer? Your crew will never fully accept you for what you are. Sooner or later, they will turn against you. They're my friends. I'm a voice inside your own head. You already know it's true. Why didn't we see this before? In the early stages, the virus disguised itself. How far has it progressed? You just lost navigation. Several other systems will be compromised in a matter of minutes. And you're sure the android is responsible? The android you know and remember is already gone. The programming that made up her personality has been superseded by a new directive. There has to be a way to get her back. I'm afraid there's not. You just lost power regulation. You have to act now. Three, this is two. Go ahead. I can't believe I'm saying this, but I don't think we have a choice. We have to take her out. Well. If we're gonna do it, I guess we better just do it. Android, don't. It wasn't her. Three, hold off. Seriously. I've seen the virus. It's real. Yeah, I know, but we can't trust anything she's telling us. Why not? Because I think she might be infected, too. I went to check, and I couldn't find the original simulation program. It's just gone, which means it must have been overwritten. You couldn't find it because I moved it to a folder containing non-essential programs, knowing that the virus would attack critical systems first. Five. No, no, she can't do that. She's lying. I can prove it. I just need more time. You're out of time. You have to act now. Take the shot. What the hell? Take the shot or lose the ship. Boss lady, I'm gonna need a call on this. You don't want to kill her any more than I do. Come on, two. What's it gonna be? I don't know. I'm not sure. Oh, this is ridiculous. I need some answers. What the hell is this? You send us down there to shoot the robot. I'm this close to pulling the trigger, then you pull me off. You just leave me hanging there. I... I got it. I knew it. You got what? I uploaded a worm to trace back the progress of the virus. It didn't start when the android went on the charging platform. It started before that, when the simulation was activated. I, I knew we couldn't trust her. She's just a projection. How can she create a virus? Uh, she didn't create it, but whoever did uploaded it into her program. It was dormant until we activated her, and then it spread from there. The timing lines up perfectly. It can't be a coincidence. Well, we can't shoot a projection in the head. How do we deal with this? Virus. It's leaking toxic gas from the coolant system. I, I can't shut it down. We're locked out. Has the virus spread to the Marauder? No, it hasn't. That's it. Everyone, let's go now. Come on. Everyone in 
inside. Seal the doors. I'll stay out here and deal with this. What are you going to do? The only way to get rid of the virus is to pull the computer core. Your nanites won't protect you forever. Don't worry, I've got a plan. Now go. you'll be stranded. The Raza will drift for a thousand years before anyone finds it. You can't fly the ship without the computer. What about the android? She could do it, couldn't she? No. You're lying. That's why you wanted us to kill her so badly. You overplayed your hand. You'll never make it to the core. guilty because you're taking time for yourself instead of serving the crew no no it's more than that my friends are in danger are you sure are you absolutely certain that they're your friends I'm sorry I have to go was a good idea, but you forgot one thing. It has a wireless connection to the ship. The virus just breached the firewall and has dialed up your magnetic boots by 300%. I'm afraid it's over. I wouldn't be so sure. Two, can I be of assistance? Get to systems control and pull the computer core. As you wish. If you proceed, I'll kill her. Android, something's happening. I've disabled power regulation in this section, allowing a static charge to build in the corridor. If it releases, she won't survive. Two, she's threatening to kill you if I don't stop. She can do it. Pull the core and save the ship. That's an order. Understood. doing this why do you care about them they were prepared to destroy you, you will regret this According to the android, you survived what should have been a fatal execution. Probably thanks to your recent nanite upgrade. The virus is gone. 
and everyone's okay, but the ship's in bad shape. Do we know where it came from? Uh, best guess, the other Truffaut. She had complete control of the ship, access to all systems, and when you forced her to give it back... She left a little something behind. The android is working on repairs, but it's slow going. Android, come in. Go ahead. What's our status? Life support has been restored, but most other systems are still down. Unfortunately, repairs will take quite some time. Well, have you restored your neural link? That should speed things up. I wasn't sure you wanted me to do that. Of course I do. Are you sure the others feel the same? Give me an open channel. I want everyone to hear this. Go ahead. Everyone, I'm going to instruct the android to reestablish her neural link so that she can effect repairs more efficiently. Any objections? I should warn you. Although I'll do my very best, I can't guarantee I'll never make another mistake. You're our ship's android, and we need you. Android, this is four. Will I be able to use a computer in my quarters? It should be all right. Although you'll have no access to the ship's systems. I just want to open a file. If you've saved the data separately from the main computer, it should be fine. Understood.